welcome back everybody welcome if you are new today episode 90 of the career mode we got the showcase here at texas second episode of this season at least we're second in points only by four behind sheldon we're having a great season so far we got second at durango should have had second at lima lamb but messed up last lap finished sixth got eighth at i-55 and we should have had second or third at volusia but we got six because of the last lap so it's been like a good good year but we could have had uh the points lead at this point honestly with uh, getting like four, three or four spots out of those first uh, two or three races here where we got six. We could have gotten two or three more spots out of that. Definitely could be in the lead there, but it is what it is. Today we got Texas, Old Mill, Knoxville, and Fairbury to end it off. We should do pretty well. Hopefully we could try to end up with the points lead at some point in this uh, episode. We do have the showcase here, so it's going to be a very tough one, but hopefully we can do pretty well. All right, we were like half a tenth off of the practice goal. We're really fast, it feels like. So hopefully we could try to run that again here in qualifying. But top five for qualifying is a 215. So we might qualify like mid-teens like we normally do. But that's all right. We're at a showcase race. It's going to be harder anyways, usually because of that. I think we could do pretty well, though, here. feel like we have a lot of speed. If we had that engine, we might have been able to get that top five goal in practice. I definitely think we would have. But that was a really good first lap, 5.48, so a little bit off of our practice time. But my time I ran, I ran so smooth that one lap. Other than that, I've ran a couple of times in the low fives. I just couldn't get any quicker than that. 5.44, 17th, that's not too bad. Got a little bit of work to do, but we could, we could uh, make it to the A main. We're starting third in heat five. Top three do make it. Uh, where's Sheldon and them? Sheldon's up in fourth. Swindell, gravel shots up in the top four. My cat's already attacking my... Mike, can you get down, bud? Thank you. But we're starting in third here. We just got to finish right here. I don't know who that number seven is. Is that Sides, maybe? It is Sides. I knew he had a red card. I just wasn't sure what number he was. And we got Spencer in first. We got in front of Sides quick. Hopefully, we can hold this off. That'd be awesome if we can make it to this qualifying dash. We've made it to the qualifying dash all besides one race so far this year. I think the Durango, where we ended up finishing the best so far, is when we didn't get the qualifying dash, which is quite funny. Every other race we've been in the qualifying dash, which has been awesome. But so far we're holding off sides just fine. He's not right on us or anything. We're not holding him up really. Two laps left. We've got 20 laps in the main. Okay, now he's right on us and we're holding him up. All I gotta do is hook the bottom, though, the best we can, and we'll block his momentum off. One lap left. Texas has been a really good track for me. I really enjoy this track. It's a pretty big track, but not too big. So you don't need the engine necessarily to be good here. And we got second. That's awesome. We're gonna start top 12, I think it is, in the feature race. Okay, yeah, 11th, because there's six heats for the uh, showcase races. So hopefully we can gain some spots here, starting in 11th. McFadden's right up there, Casey Kane's to our outside. We'll see if we can gain some spots here. Being on the bottom to start with, maybe right rear him a little bit, yep. Just like the first episode of this season, we're not making any friends, we're being real aggressive. Had to back off there a little bit to not get into Brock and go flipping, we are three wide. Try to block both these guys' momentum behind me. Ran too high there. I overcorrected that because I don't want to be right reared. If we get right reared, we go flying. I can kind of right rear some guys and make it work. But I cannot be the one getting right reared or it's going to be bad for us. Swindell's out in the lead. We got up to 10th. We could be up in like 8th or something, I feel like. But we screwed up a little bit, staying a little too high. Might be able to get Brock here. Oh, that was a great corner. I didn't even have to right rear him. Just stick right on the bottom. We're going to be ninth on the start of the A main. That's awesome. That's a lot better than what we qualified at. Great, great run in the dash. And we should have a little bit more speed in the main. I think we can honestly can get up to that top five for our sponsor goal, which would be really good, especially for these showcase races. Just have to run nice and smooth like we have been so far, especially right off these starts and restarts. Just hook the bottom the best we can since we're already down here. Get a spot quick from Carson. Almost got up in the suite, but we're going to get in front of him as well. But we're going to be stuck three wide. McFadden got to our inside. 
Try to get back down low and get under McFadden. Don't hit that tire. Jeez, I almost went too low there. Oh, sweet. Really sent it in. I was act I didn't think he was going to. I was trying to cut off his momentum, but luckily we didn't get sent. I got lucky with that. Definitely got lucky there. Slide up in front of Sweet. He's going to cross us back over. No, he doesn't. We're up in seventh. That's solid. All right. I need to just lock in and hit my line because I keep bouncing off the bottom way too much because the angle I'm like going into these corners is awful. I just need to run like that every corner. We're in eighth. That's not bad. We still have a lot of time left. 15 laps to go. There might be a restart or two later on also. You never know. Trying to see if we could throw a slider on Sweet and check his momentum up. Because he's running way up top. But everybody's starting to gain speed now. Which is not useful for me. Shots is starting to work the bottom and get by Logan up there. Swindell's still way out in the lead. I think Gravel's in second, it looks like. Where is Sheldon? He's like fourth, fifth area right up there. Ooh, him and Shots got together a little. Sheldon got checked up a ton from that. He's back to sixth now. I ran too high. Got Carson really battling us now. But we're battling up here with all the fast guys at least, which is awesome. They're all getting around Logan there. We'll see if we can try to follow them on through. All that battling they're doing really is check them all up. And Logan's running the middle. Which isn't the fastest lane. We got the seventh. Let's see if we can try to get up the sixth here. I want to try to throw a slider on sweet. Oh, right rear the hell out of him. And I flipped him. <laughs> Yikes. That was uh, too tight of a slider. That was not clear, but... It is what it is. I really was trying to send it there. And I, I damn sure sent it. I can tell you that. And I sent him. We're not making any friends in this season at all. Trying to just win a championship here. Get down to the bottom. Try to get under Sheldon. He ran well on the bottom though. Try to get into this top five. We're three wide. Pinch off Sheldon. I need to get back to running good on the bottom. Just like that. And we're in fourth. Don't get the wall. Damn it. Okay, we're gonna have somebody. Nope, nobody's her inside. We're good. I thought for sure somebody was gonna be on my inside for me running high. If we can hold the bottom the rest of this race, we only got, what, four laps left? We can get fourth easy. Oh, and look at Spencer battling Swindell up there for the lead. Shots is making a run at us now. But as long as I hold the bottom, we'll be good. I have my cat behind my monitors, and I'm really worried about him unplugging something. Really need this race to finish. Spencer has gotten a massive lead now. We have a good lead over Shots as well, so that's great. We're in fourth really nice. My cat's leaving, thank God. But we're solidly in fourth. Uh, don't know where Sheldon's at. We should have the points lead after this race. Because Shots was tied with us. We were four behind Sheldon. We got fourth. So I'm very happy about that. Where did Sheldon finish though? He finished all the way back in 10th. Okay, we're ahead of him by far. We're going to be two points ahead of Shots. And I think that will be all I know off the top of my head. We should have the points lead though. That is awesome. First points lead of the 410 series. This is the third season we've been in it. We got the points lead. Let's freaking go. Spencer got that win. He's back there in eighth. He's had a rough race uh, already. Brad Sweet's all the way back in 10th. I need to see where he finished because I right reared the hell out of him into the wall. Gravel is only four points back from us and Shots is two points back from us. But hey, we got the points lead. That's all that matters. Did uh, Sweet finish so far? Oh, he finished 22nd. Yikes. That is rough for him. But it is what it is. We got fourth out of it. I'll take that. We're not making no friends. 126,000 on the dot for fourth place. That is awesome. Way over 200,000 for that race. If we could have gotten that sponsor goal, it would have been nice. Just a little bit over like 235,000 or something like that. That would have been really cool. But we have a points lead now. Let's see if we can try to hold it the rest of the year. All right. Parts are still pretty good. We're at $1.3 million. And we got two out of three top five goals. That's not too bad. We got like, what, 62,000 from that? 
something like that because i think it was thirty-one thousand every time we got a top 10 or top five now we're on to old mill we're gonna keep our sponsor of iRacing it pays out a ton per race no reason to go to anywhere else and for a five race span if we can get multiple races in the top five it's way more useful than getting either of these even though we could probably like perfect these you get one or two of these and it's more worth it for sure so we're going on to old mill i need to move this up to 50 percent for the 20 laps and we'll be good to go hopefully we can hold on to the points lead i can't remember if we did well at old mill last season or not i think i like surprised myself and did pretty well here but i don't quite remember i think we ended up with like a top 10 or close to a top 10 here last season when our car wasn't amazing but we're getting close to getting this engine it's like 1.8 million or something like that 1.9 something like that so we'll be getting that pretty soon especially if we can keep up getting that kind of money every race well we have some speed we got the practice goal and we're only like a tenth behind the qualifying goal so we'll see if we could do that we might qualify a top 10 here if i can hit that seven once again not really going to try to get a run in because i'm probably just going to smack the wall i was trying to take it nice and easy on the bottom like letting off roll on the bottom and then getting on throttle but that was like two tenths slower than just mashing the gas and getting the angle for the corner if i don't hit the outside wall we should be good that's going to be a better lap. We had a 962. That's a 791. That's 11. Oh, really? I thought the sevens might put us at least top 10, but that's all right. Number three in heat number one. We're starting at at least. Uh, Swindell's out front once again. Gravel is up there. So Gravel, Sheldon, Shot are the guys we're mainly battling right now. So we got to watch out for them. Let's see if we could try to move up at least a second here. We have to pass shots on the outside to get into that qualifying dash. Were there only four heats? I did not pay attention enough. Really not sure. Oh, we might get the lead out of that. Block off Swindell. Hell yeah, we got the lead off of that one. We're in heat number one. If we could win this, that put us in first for the qualifying dash. I don't know why Swindell went so wide. That's crazy. Shot is trying to get to my inside. Oh, he did right there. I'm gonna try to cross him back over. Go way down the apron. He's gonna cross us back over almost. Really can use that apron to throw a slider on somebody at least. Try to block shots off there because he is really trying to get to the inside. Come on, last lap. Can we hold him off? We do hold him off. Let's go. We're gonna start first in the qualifying dash. That was huge. I'm shocked that Swindell went so wide like first lap and we got by both of them in turn three that was awesome shots got up the second swindell fell all the way back to just making the a main instead of uh actually being in the qualifying dash which is crazy he qualified pole and he's not even making the qualifying dash that never happens i feel like just don't have too bad of an angle coming off of this and let's just try to hit our marks oh god carson's to our inside try to cross oh jesus i was gonna try to cross him back over like we did with shots but that didn't happen sheldon ended up getting up to the lead before the caution came out that's unfortunate but hopefully we can cross down real quick because i was trying to do the same thing i did the shots but carson like checked up a ton more than shots did the in the heat race that was weird okay let's cross sheldon over okay that was not crossing over at all i just punted his ass out the way that might be a caution though it's not a caution okay i was expecting a caution honestly but it never came out got back to the lead though got to be aggressive and there's a caution okay that was a little late for one i don't know what the caution was for on that one unless that was when i crossed back down and got into somebody i'm not 100 percent sure honestly hopefully we could run away in the damn a main we might be able to win this race it seems really just need to hit our line not give up the bottom at all logan is right on us carson gotten past him now but we're on the final lap we're gonna start on the pole for the a main we should be able to run away with this thing lap traffic's gonna be a pain in the ass though here for sure lap traffic is awful at old mill because the uh they like to run the inside all the way up until i get to them and then they like really stay inside they run they run the outside a decent bit but i've seen where they get out of the way for the leader and then i'm like coming up from lap for lap traffic and then they come down all of a sudden so hopefully lap traffic won't be too bad we got 20 laps it got so dark all of a sudden 
They really got to nighttime here, but we should be able to run away with this thing, honestly. These small tracks, we do really well at, and we don't even need the engine for it. The bigger tracks, we struggle at more, and we still have been doing pretty damn well with them. Getting that engine is going to help a ton. We should be able to win the championship this year. We're doing quite well. Pretty much every race has been about a top five. Yeah, we already have a two-second lead. Holy crap, we are ripping right now. I'm hitting, like... My line's perfect, except that corner, until I talk about it. <laughs> Can't go down that apron, because that's just going to slow you up. Now we just got to watch out for all these maniacs up here. We're going to have to get by them as smart as we can. They are three wide. Don't know if that's quite smart here. Watch out if anybody ends up wrecking. Just got to move out of the way as quick as we can. I don't want a lot of damage on the car. Try not to get too aggressive with these guys just so we don't go flying by accident. Because uh, anything could happen when you tap wheels and stuff in these cars. Please don't send it on the inside of me. I hate you. Jacob Allen. Two first name have an ass. I hate when the lap cars really just send it back on the inside like this. Why? Why? You, you were so slow until I caught you and got by you. I need to get away from him. Really just hug the bottom. Oh, there's a wreck. Okay, damn, that guy went flipping. That guy is going into the crowd there. Okay. We might not have to deal with any more lap traffic, except that guy is going to be really slow from that flip, honestly. Because we don't have too many laps left. We've ran such a clean race so far. Stayed out of the lap cars for the most part. We just need to try to keep up what we're doing we don't have too many laps left there's gonna be one guy super off pace from that wreck i think and uh we might catch him by the end of it what the hell am i doing there that was the worst line i've ran yet and swindell's all the way back up here in a second where did he come from he didn't even make the qualifying dash and he still made it all the way up to second that's crazy all right we got to hit our line just about perfect and get away from him Oh, we still are catching some lap traffic. There's like three guys really slow, but I think the front one of the three might be the guy that was in the wreck and slowing all these guys up. But we only got three laps left. Actually, we're just catching lap traffic quick anyways. Okay. Oh, got the wall. Swindell's catching us. Lap traffic, please stay, stay out of the way. Please. Tim's is the one that's really, really slow, it seems like. Move out the way. Okay, we got by that as clean as we could, as quick as we could. We're on the final lap. No more lap traffic. And we're going to come home winners here. Let's go. That's huge for the points. We already had the points lead by two, and now we're going to pull away some. That's great. And Swindell got second. He's nowhere near us in the points. What a solid race by us. Sheldon got fourth. Shots got fifth. Who was the other one? Gravel got seventh. So, yeah, that was a big points day for us for sure. Let's freaking go. It's our second win in the four tens now. We won at Diamond Grove last season. And now we have an a 12-point uh, lead. I thought it was eight at first, but 12-point lead there. Let's freaking go. We got we're, we got the win. Sweet has two of them, but he's back there in 10th. He's had two really bad races. And who ended up in that wreck that finished, like, super far back there? I don't 100% know. Could be... It, oh, I'm wait, already by it. It could have been Tim's, I think. He finished 25th out of that. And uh, Casey Kane finished back in 17th. That sucks for him. Logan back in 16th. Damn, that's a rough day for them. And uh, just a lot of the faster guys up front for the most part. But great day for us. 130000 for first place. We got our sponsor goal for practice. This was just such a good day. 241000 We're getting really close to uh, that engine. It might just be one or two more races, honestly. Going to repair the parts now because I think we're going into Knoxville. And uh, I want our parts to be as good as they can for Knoxville. We went at Old Mill. Honestly, surprised we have not gotten too many hate messages this season. I don't think we've had any so far yet, and I've been aggressive as hell right rear in everybody. So I'm shocked about that, honestly. Let's repair all those parts. 37,000. And I want to say this is like 1.8, 1.9 million. So it's going to be like one or two more races. I think start of next episode, we'll be able to get it. Uh, Knoxville, we might do all right at. It's going to be rough because it's a bigger track. But Fairbury, we should, do, we should do pretty well at. It's a smaller track, and it's been a good track for us in every series pretty much. So uh, let's see how we do here at Knoxville. All right, we were only like a tenth off of the practice goal. I honestly think if we did a little bit of the gear ratio changing, it, I could hit that, but I'm not that worried about it. We usually do pretty well in the A main here anyways. We have to pass a lot of cars a lot of the time, so not that worried about it. Try to get a lot of speed up here for our lap, 
and just gotta hug the bottom the best that we can hopefully we have a decent lap here watch us get like a low three or something like that enough to get the practice goal that's what happens a lot here in qualifying i feel like if we don't hit the practice goal 552 okay we were a little off a little bit off honestly i don't remember if i ran outside for my lap or not a little bit because it does give you a little bit of a speed boost up there if you hit the right rear perfect on that a little faster in the second lap 19th we do usually qualify a little further back here because it's a bigger track that engine would help out a lot here starting fourth in heat four who is up there on pole we got shots gravel sweet carson and logan up there normal suspects hopefully we can try to gain a spot here got to get by is that logan door no it's not logan door i think that's jacob allen i want to say it sure is okay we should be able to beat him out i would think i almost got into his tire and the guy behind me really sent it in that's gonna be a caution <laughs> i was just trying to get in the middle and luckily we didn't go flying i got very lucky with that honestly because a lot of the times we end up uh going head on into the wall from that so i got very lucky there but we get a good enough jump on this outside. I can't quite get down. I'm trying to back off a little bit, get down. That worked out a lot better this time. But that slows us down so much for the first corner. But I really need to get that bottom so I don't have somebody on my inside. They run outside. Kind of shocked by that. Might be able to throw a slider here on Allen. Gonna go way down, slide up here. That actually worked quite well. I feel like we should have been able to get by Allen. No problem. Jewel, maybe. It'd be tough. We only have two laps left, so I don't know if we're going to be able to catch him in time. We'll see. I do think this outside lane is pretty quick. If I can hit it right. Allen got right to our bumper, though. Because I remember in the street stocks where I first found it, I was able to run that outside lane all the way around the corner. Maybe get a little bit of a cut down and it was really really fast like i definitely improved my lap times a ton but these sprint cars are so much harder to control up there for me so i'll take third there that'll start us what like five more positions up something like that like 14th yeah 14th in the a main i'll take that it's a lot better than 19th a lot less cars we have to try to pass to get up to the top five we'll see if we can hopefully we can move our way up though need to get to the bottom did that successfully always worried about that these tracks where we get like too good of a start side by side with the guy on the bottom i like dropping off a little bit and being able to drop down below them quickly damn sheldon's all the way back here in 10th oh whoops case Kane, cat get off of me my cat was on my elbow there's definitely gonna be a caution we're just riding the wall <laughs> we're stuck on the wall my cat is right here i don't know if you saw him on my arm he might have popped in the frame for a second but that was not a very good corner. We were almost into the top 10 already and then uh, clipped somebody's tire. Back off a little bit, get down. Now my cat's next to me on my table. Oh, stop moving the mic, cat. He moved it further away. Oh, he moved it. Oh, no, he's moving it so far away. Cat, stop it. I got to get him down. Oh, but we're mid corner. This is going to be bad. Okay, we're fine. I thought, honestly thought that was going to be a lot worse and nobody was next to us, thank God. Oh, damn it. I was really trying. Oh, that. Oh, God. We were flipping and we have so much damage. Is there no caution? Okay. I was going to say, if we didn't get a caution for that, that was going to be some BS. Damn, that sucked. We were flipping through the air. <laughs> I'm getting my uh, payback from all the races so far this year in this one race. <laughs> I was really just trying to pinch the guy down and barely tapped his tire. That sucked. Oh, I'm trying to get down. Really did not have the room to get down, though trying to keep the bottom the best we can because these guys do get off the bottom a little bit we're able to make some passes we have a little bit of damage but luckily no radiator or engine damage oh we're getting sent again holy shit we're just flipping in this one we definitely made no friends this season <laughs> i can tell you that for a fact we made zero friends and it's just gonna drive us into the bottom but damn this has been a rough race for us because we get too good of a start, I can't get down very easy, and it's just not good. How damage are we now? Still only 84 in the air. I'm shocked by that. Very, very shocked by that. I think uh, GS is really slow from that first wreck, honestly. It seems like. We're able to pass so many guys back here early on. 
Oh, they're flipping up there. Okay, that should get us. That got us up to 14th. Nice. Making all the positions back. We just made up 10 positions in like one lap. <laughs> but I keep restarting on the outside. Every damn restart has been outside so far. And it's really annoying. I don't like the outside. I don't know what my cat's doing now. He's behind my stuff again. All right, I need to get down. I really want to restart on the bottom. Because I slide up a little bit too there. We're fine. Yeah, I don't know who got flipped into the wall there. At least that one wasn't uh, involving me. I'm shocked. Oh, God. Oh, God. We got sent up here. I'm sorry. And that's a caution. We're going to be 12th. Nice. On the outside once again. This is a ridiculous way race. I think I don't know if that was Carson that was behind me or who's another red or uh, white car like that. Bill Rose, maybe? I didn't see the number or anything. I think it might have just been a straight white car. So it might have been Bill Rose. I don't think it was Carson because I didn't see any green. And Carson, I see up there. So, yeah, it definitely wasn't him. And we're still up here with Sheldon. Shocked by that. We've gone through half this race because it's all been cautioned so far. Oh, I'm in the wall. That's not where I want to be. Especially because they get to my inside. I'm shocked I did not go flying there. It had a little spark. We got lucky. McFadden didn't send us into the wall. Try to keep the bottom here. See if we can get some green flag laps. <laughs> See if we can't get to this top five. McFadden's running like middle of the track for no damn reason. I don't know why he's... Oh, I overcorrected the hell out of that. I was trying to straighten out the car. Because I didn't want to get flipped from Spencer there. How damaged are we? 83? We're honestly not as damaged as I think we should have been. So I'm lucky with that. Very, very lucky there. Jewel is up here somehow still. Oh, God. I keep overcorrecting it down the straight right now. Like, the car is just too twitchy on the straights for me. Get in front of Sheldon there. He's going to cross us back down. We're going to block it off. I think we're going to be able to get in front of Jewel at least. Get up to 8th. 8th has been our worst finish all season so far yet. So, if we could finish 8th, I'd be all right with that after this race. We could have finished a lot worse, honestly. We could have some radiator or engine damage. It could have been really bad. Definitely catching him. We're catching McFadden as well up here. Try to get up, block Jewel. That did not happen. We got him. We right reared him a little bit, but he didn't go spinning at least. That's good. I did not need a restart. Well, I didn't want a restart because I, with how the restarts have been so far, I feel like 90% of them we've wrecked so far. Let's get in front of McFadden. Okay, never mind. Let's not get in front of McFadden. I wasn't trying to get into him, but we did. Oh, geez. Spencer's pinching us up to the wall, and Jewel is going flipping. That's going to put us in ninth. That should be a caution, yeah? Oh, no, that was a finish. Oh. <laughs> Jewel got fucked there. Jewel 100% got screwed there. That's crazy. He, where'd he finish? Where did Jewel finish? He only finished back in 14th. Could have been a lot worse for him, honestly. I'm shocked by that. That's crazy. Who ended up winning it? Shots did. Gravel up in third. We finish in front of Sheldon still, so Shots and Gravel are going to be real close to us in points. Actually, Shots might have the points lead now. Let's take a look at who does have the points lead. We are second. I think Shots took it over. Yeah, by only six, though, so we're still pretty close. We're six ahead of Gravel as well. Now, Carson is ahead of Sheldon. He is 14 back from us, so getting a lot tighter up front with a lot more people. Definitely a bad race for us finishing ninth, but Knoxville is usually pretty tough. 85,000 still for ninth. That's not too bad. Our sponsor payout went up. Let's go. 106,000 for our sponsor payout. Still 200,000 on the day. That is crazy. Wasn't expecting the uh, sponsor payout to go up like that. That's awesome. Everything got pretty worn out in that one race because we did repair everything before the race, but I'll just move on, go to Fair, uh, Fairbury. We should be able to do pretty good there with the parts like that. But uh, hopefully we can get a top five there, maybe win it as well because we are pretty good at Fairbury. I can't quite remember where we finished last season here. I think we made it to the qualifying dash, but I think we got like, I think we wrecked or something in the race. Not got wrecked. We definitely wrecked, I feel like, in that race because it's a small track, very tough racing, tight racing too. So let's try to do the best we can, see if we can win it, and I think after this race, I'll be able to get the engine all the way, because I want to say that we don't have enough money yet. I'll do the math real quick, but I definitely think uh, we're a little short. Yeah, we are just under $200,000 short. It's like $1.945 so I think after this race, if we do well enough, we definitely can get that. All right, we hit multiple times in like the mid to low seven. So we got the practice goal pretty easy. I'm really happy about that. Don't think we'll be able to get the top five for qualifying here. That's really, really fast. 
try to get as much oh never mind let's try to uh reset that and see if uh we can't get some speed here i don't know if this is gonna like disqualify us or anything i want to try to get speed into that corner i've never done this before yet on this game but i really screwed up that corner i wanted the speed all right, that worked. Luckily, it didn't like disqualify us or anything. And still had a terrible turn one, so it did not matter. <laughs> See how we do, though. Hopefully, this second lap might be a little better. That was an 898. Not awful, but not great. I know we can get quicker than that. I think I went too low three and four the last time. That was a decent lap. That was 765, about what I was running in practice. That's 12th. That's a pretty good time. We're just going to put us third in heat two. Okay, let's see if we can try to make it to the qualifying dash from that. We're starting on the bottom. Sweet, Swindell, Shots up there. Jacob Allen up there. That's kind of random. Uh, Gravel's all the way back in ninth. Okay, cool. So uh, some of the guys are struggling, but some of them are really fast still. We'll see if we can try to get by second place here. That's Logan. Let's see if we can get by Logan here off the start. Try to run the bottom. Because this track definitely is pretty bad with uh, the contact and stuff getting in the people. I was trying to cut him off there in that corner and we had to run high. Oh god, we're now we're just in the hornet's nest. That's great. Let's just get back up to third. And that's a caution. Okay, wasn't expecting the caution, but that'll help us out. Definitely did not want to be back there like fourth, fifth by any means. That would have been really bad. If we could at least start 12th in the A main, I think we'll have a good shot at doing really well. How damaged are we from that? 94, not awful. Try to be a little bit more aggressive off the start. Get in front of Logan. Ooh, might be able to get in front of Swindell there too. Nice, slide up in front of him. One lap to go. Oh, is he gonna get back to our inside? He does. Can I run high? Get that momentum. Oh, oh, second at the line. Wow, that was tight. That was so close to the line. Damn it. He had just a little bit better of a runoff. I wanna see the timing on that five thousandths of a second we were dead even at the line just about that is nuts holy crap that was so close that would have made us start second though in the dash race here that would have been awesome instead we're seventh but that's all right at least we're top 10 instead of 12 so it's a it's improvement at least we're already three wide here i'm gonna try to block off the bottom and we got in the spencer there that was a big wreck between everybody behind us <laughs> <laughs> gotta be aggressive don't make any friends we're not here to make friends we're here to win championships that's all we're here for right now this paint scheme's just out for all blood if you saw the first episode of the the season not first episode ever but <laughs> the first episode this season because ch i've been changing the uh, paint scheme every year in the four tens oh that did not help out at all not doing a wheelie is not fast it looks cool but it's not fast see if we can try to get some spots back here oh i thought i was gonna slide up in front of sheldon i was gonna slide up in front of sheldon there that might be a caution actually yes it is we're gonna have one more restart here at least so we're gonna have a green white checker here in the qualifying dash but i thought well, i was gonna slide up in front of sheldon but he ran middle to go on the inside of gravel which i was not expecting we'll see how this goes try to get down under gravel real quick Oh, that didn't go well. Okay, we're fine. Everybody's still green. Somehow, we made it safe through all that. Try to slide up there. Get the momentum. We're still seventh. Let's see if we can rip the outside. Nope, I slammed the wall. Damn, I went from seventh there to ninth in the last lap. That sucks. Oh, well. Still starting ninth. We should be really fast in this A main as long as I don't do anything stupid. I think we could uh, get to that top five and compete for the win, honestly. It depends on where the cautions fall at. But I think we can do pretty well. Just got to be smart about this. Jacob Allen's all the way up there in fifth, and I definitely, definitely think we're quicker than him. We're quicker than him just about every week. Went way too low there because that banking down there is like opposite. Try to hold the bottom, though, so nobody gets to our inside the best we can. Swindell's got the lead. We're already battling the top five now. Damn, Jacob Allen is ripping that top side. He is fast. That's so random, though, because he, he's not really that fast every week. He's pro It's probably like a home track for him or something, and he's really good here, I'm assuming. 
Let's right rear him and ruin that. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> if it happens, it happens. Oh, slide in front of Sheldon. Didn't know if I was going to right rear Sheldon or get that slider correct on him. That's why right rearing is terrifying. I'm shocked we did not lose it and go into the wall. That was amazing, honestly. Because I was trying to stay out of Sheldon because the way we were hitting him, it was like right on his tire. So I didn't want to go flipping. There is a caution there. We're in sixth. Okay. Not sure where the caution's at. It looks like it's in the back because everybody started checking up really hard there. Should be able to get down behind Spencer here real quick. It's not doing anything too dumb. We're in a good position. I could have probably thrown a slider on everybody. They've been second. I should have, but I wasn't expecting Jacob Allen to go high. But he has been running high like the entire race so far, so maybe I should have expected it. But we're in third. Let's just not ruin this. We're doing amazing. We're going to be able to slide up in front of him there off of turn two. Oh, he's going to get back to our inside, though. We're going to cross him back over going into one. Just got to keep our car wide so he doesn't get back under us. He does get back under us. Damn. Jacob Allen is strong here. Well, we got back up the second there. Let's see if we can try to catch Swindell. Screwed up that corner. Just a little bit. Good run on the exit, though. I'll take second, though. There's been multiple times this season we have lost second place on the final lap and we finished sixth both times. So definitely want to try to finish top five at least. Finish second would be awesome. McFadden must have ended up in one of those wrecks because he is really slow, which is uncharacteristic for him. Him and uh, Jacob Allen like switched places this week. And then look, all the all the AI go bottom. They, they were all top for Swindell. Then they just go straight bottom for me. That's great. Oh, we got Sweet to our inside. I'm trying to block him off. Almost nailed that guy in 21st. Oh, geez. We got wheel hopped by Sweet there. Came down onto Jacob Allen. The lap cars are just such a pain in the ass for me. Got two laps left. Come on. We can hold on to third here, hopefully, if I don't drive the corners like that. Just got to hold it right on the bottom. Stay off the guys on the outside. Sides decides to go three wide there. Thank you. We love that. We got Tim's in front of us. We don't have to worry about him. Nice. Let's go. We got third. I'm very happy with that. Solid, solid day. Tough racing, especially getting around those lap cars are terrifying all the time. So we might get the points lead back or no, we're going to be who had the points lead. Was it gravel? Where did gravel finish? Where was Gravel? He's 25th. Wow. He must have ended up in a wreck. That's crazy. So he's going to lose a ton of points there. And I don't remember if we were just behind Shots or we were just behind Gravel. I think Gravel was behind us already. And I think we're going to be two points behind Shots here. Let's take a look and see. We got third, so that's awesome. We should be able to get that engine. We're still second, so I think we're two points behind him. Yep, two points behind Shots. Swindell is making a comeback. Wow, that's crazy. He's only 18 points back from us yeah he's only 18 points back from us but he gets multiple wins a year he's doing really really well again so we got to watch out for him but we need to just keep on trucking doing what we're doing 120,000 for third place definitely got enough money there to go and get that engine that's going to help us out the rest of the season and uh we should be able to get some more wins definitely need to repair the parts but i'm gonna go and buy that engine first because i feel like that's gonna be more needed if anything i'll just repair the tires by themselves but we got over two million now that's awesome we're going on the millstone but let's get this engine fully upgraded that's going to help us out so much it's going to be great especially for these bigger tracks that we have left on the season we don't have too many but uh we we definitely are going to be faster at those tracks like charlotte at the end of the year sixty one thousand dollars left on the budgets we had twenty six thousand dollars in repairs thirty four thousand dollars left but still got half the year left to build up some money for the supers that are going to be coming up next season if we win this season we should be able to win but uh next episode we got millstone which is a half mile track so that will be useful with the engine bristol that's just a tough one in general 
Kenyon's not a very big track, but we already got the pole there last uh, season. So hopefully we can do that again. And Las Vegas. So next episode, the engine's definitely going to be put to the test with uh, at least Millstone and Las Vegas. Maybe Bristol as well, because it is a, a half mile also, but going to be a tough one. So appreciate you guys for watching. As always, hopefully you guys are enjoying the career mode. Really tight uh, points battle up front here. And uh, Gravel fell all the way back to 7th there in the standings. That's crazy. But really a tight points battle here going to the second half of the season. Hopefully we could win it. We already got one win this season. I think we can get some more with that engine upgrade. Fully decked out uh, for a 10 car now. Everything is upgraded as much as possible. So hopefully we, hopefully we can keep it up and uh, keep getting some top fives. We're doing great with that. So appreciate you guys for watching as always. And I'll catch you guys in the next one.